Welcome back everyone to Punny Plays the Burglar. We are back here in Anazarmechem. We were here once before to search for a page for Bingo Boffin. Now we're here to get some iron bars and wooden slats and maybe kill a Gashai or two. And we also have another riddle. So let's see what's on this one. Weight in my belly. Trees are my back, nails in my ribs, feet do I lack. So I'll need some plays which will answer that specific riddle. And everything here is level 57 or 58. So I am going to turn on the stone for a moment. Now, this quest ring right here, this is with the Relic Master, and that's, I believe, for making relics. And since I won't be making, crafting any relics, I think I'll just leave that piece. So we'll go to Gopi instead. Stay a moment. We will need your aid against the Orcs of Moria. Wood is in short supply in Haza Doom, and the scaffold pieces found around the Flaming Deeps could prove useful for the repair efforts being performed beneath the crossroads of ash. There should be a decent supply of scaffold pieces found throughout the tunnels east of Hadad Mazer. Very well, we'll look for those. Now, I don't know yet if I'm going to be doing any quests in this section, or I should say a significant number of them, because I don't know how useful the virtue you get for this one will be. So we shall see and head out. I have been doing a lot of the quest. Actually, there's probably a Maida deed. Not quest deed. There's probably a Maida deed somewhere for Moria overall for completing quests in Casa Doom. Increased reputation, which will probably be unnecessary. A hundred. Right, that's it. Yep, yeah, I don't need to do all the areas then. I'm getting up to be 58, so at this rate I'll be ready for Lothlorien soon. And in fact, I'm at a level that could probably head outside as soon as we are done with the epic, but if there's if there are any sections that are useful such as giving good good virtues or the like, one of those example areas will of course be the the waterworks. I still want to get that point of innocence even though I haven't exactly been swift on working on the quests in that area. But it would be nice to go and get that point of innocence and actually do it. I think I would have worked on it a little bit more if it weren't for where the month boundary was because I didn't feel like being in the middle of the waterworks when we crossed from September into October. There you go. And Actually, that's a pretty poor excuse now I think but because wasn't I never mind that <laughs> the waterworks thing was done in October right okay I am already forgetting my <laughs> for forget which month is which when I am posting stuff apparently that's right because I finished off oops September with that little pair of instances. Yes, there you go. Oh, pfft. iron bars. Now the slats are not these. The scaffold pieces are in the other direction than where I went. Oh, <laughs> no, I don't need to go against the spiderling.
but I need to go is against this guy. Now, there isn't really any real credit for killing these orcs at the moment. Because you don't start getting credit for killing the orcs until after you collect all the pieces. But I'm killing them anyway. Okay, I'm not going to kill them all. I'm just going to sneak by. So I am a burglar, so I don't have to actually kill them all on my way. Especially considering that I've got the... Especially when you consider that I have this tortoise shell off. The tortoise shell on, I should say, so therefore experience is turned off. And with experience turned off, I'm, well, obviously I'm not going to be earning any XP for what I kill here. But I do need to make sure that I'm not killed when I pick up these bars and all that fun stuff. So let's kill as many orcs as possible. If they will cooperate and die, that is. I know, cooperative orcs. Who ever heard of cooperative Grashai? Yeah, that does sound like a strange little phrase to say there. Now, I'm going to pick up those things and continue along my way and perhaps I'll meet you back after I've picked up all the pieces. I found my last bar so let's take care of that and now I need to kill 20 gosh high orcs from within the flaming deeps and we'll begin with this one inconvenient that you don't even get this portion of the quest until after you finish the first part now what I'm going to do is I am going to make my way down to the other side to where the scaffolding pieces and the riddle are and that way I'll be able to find a way to complete a couple of the side quests here which will then tell me whether or not it is worthwhile to work on enough quests in this area to complete the deed or if I should just say okay I'm out of here I of course want to at least do the riddle I have the scaffold quest. I also have a another quest who somehow I picked up grimly lethal back when I was coming down here for bingo for some reason. Probably passed by a fire grim or something like that. Though that's a quest that I don't necessarily go out of my way to do because you could also finish that quest when you do battle of the Way of Smiths. So unless it's really, really need that extra one in order to finish out the deed, I don't worry about doing Grimly. I know some people like to go out of their way in order to do Grimly Lethal. I, I, I don't bother. I say, okay. Just kill those Grims when I've got a chance. And eventually I'll get that quest done while my quest for getting Skirmisher of Middle-Earth or something like that. Yeah, I didn't think I was going to be able to make that. Just see, can I kill this one before the other one sees me? Nope. Doesn't matter. He's dead anyway. I have found the location for the riddle. Here we have a horse. Now in case you forgot what the riddle was, it's weight in my belly. Well, I can see imagine 
a weight being put on his back, but on the belly, not too sure about that. Trees on the back, I don't see any trees on the back there. Here we have a horn, that's even less likely. Here we have a shield. Well, what would be the belly of a shield anyway? And a coffin. Well, we've already had the coffin, I think. There we have a cup, a ship. We'll come back to the ship in a moment. And then a bow. Now, of course, the ship, you've got weight in the belly because the belly would be the bottom part of the ship. Trees on the back, those, of course, would be the masts. And, in fact, in some regions, I believe they refer to masts as trees because, well, they're they're tall. <laughs> and, of course, nails in the ribs, nails in the ribs of the ship that hold them together down where the belly is, and feet where I like it, of course. Ships do not have feet as far as I know. At least I don't think I've ever heard of a ship with feet. There you go. With that, we solved the riddle. And now the next riddle, of course, we've got a follow-up here. The riddle is on the back of the door that you c chose when you solved the riddle of the ship. I turn round once. What is out will not get in. Around once more, and what is in will not get out. And there are three levers here. Now, All right, the choices here, that there are these tiny little things here. We have the, oh, we'll just accept it for now. All right, there you go. And we've got a snake. We've already found a snake. So, and while that doesn't make it impossible, so we have a, what is that first? Oh, footsteps, a snake, and a key. Now, the answer is a key, of course. Though I was wondering about that one a little bit because a key? Yeah, okay, yeah, you turn the key, someone does, doesn't get out. But why is turning it again cause someone not to be able to get... I guess because of the way most of the keys I have operate. Maybe some doors operate differently. All right, there you go. And that... So now I have to get back to... Anazek Mayer to turn that in. I need to kill a few more of these. Gosh, I've got a little more to go. And I do have those slats to do. I think I need to go this way in order to get those, not those slats, those pieces of scaffolding. Lots of scaffolding and a couple of orcs protecting it. How about that? Hey, 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 hey. <sighs> the patrolling patterns of these orcs is really annoying. I need improved riddle. I miss improved riddle. <laughs> actually, it's improved riddle, though. Actually, that might be a yellow line thing. Now, yeah, I don't know if all burglars get improved riddle. Hmm. That's something I'll have to check at some point. Whether that's a leveled skill or if that was just something I had when I was doing yellow line. Fruit riddle is nice because it allows you to riddle without leaving stealth which is useful in situations like that. All right, that's the first piece of scaffold. Second Third I just need to find five more of them. Our friend the wiki says that improved riddle is level 66. So that means I need to get through Mirkwood, which means getting through Moria. That doesn't exactly give me incentive to be completionist or to turn on the Tortoise stone. Now, this one right here. I 
I really should get myself some serrated knives so I could have a ranged weapon that's better than tossing a stone at somebody. Just saying. Well, that's four of these fire grims at least. Though it does make me feel a bit warm. I'm assuming that if you're surrounded by flames, it would be hard to go into stealth mode. Just thinking, it's hard to hide when you got fire surrounding you. Is that another... I'm not going out of my way to find these Grims, but if I run to any of them, I'm not going to argue with it. Well, okay, I am going to argue with the Grim. I'm not going to argue with the fortunate point of my actually being able to find the Grim. Yeah, I'll just do all the arguments against the Grim itself. Impending flame. Oh, does that do any damage? Yeah, it does do damage. There you go. Oh, and right next to some more pieces of scaffold. I may actually finish this quest. That's five of them. Let's just all right, make that six of them. Yeah, getting into the main home of the scaffolding. Orc. More scaffolding. See, how many orcs have I got right now? Wait, they're all all they're all bunched together. Scaffolding, orcs. Grims. What more could you ask for? Oh, 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 oh. No, no, no. Daddy, stop moving. That's what you could ask for. <laughs> Good grief. Well, the distraction thing is nice for getting them to stop moving. I, I mean, is great for being able to sneak behind them. The point that makes them stop is, to me, oh, is probably the more important point for me. They stop. And when you're going against patrollers and the like, oh, yes, distracting them is so great. It's seven of the Grims. I wasn't exactly expecting to get seven of the Grims by the time I got it here. Yeah, that means every... Th oh, no, I still need five more of those Orcs. Maybe I should have gone uh, against those Orcs a little bit more aggressively. Ah, just when I was saying I needed more Orcs. Look what decides to hide in the corner. Yes, he thought I was going to skip him. Thinking, oh, he must be done with his quest. I can now safely hide in the corner and no one will notice me. Sorry. Amazing. I get my last Grim before I get my last Orc. Now that I wasn't expecting. I certainly wasn't expecting this to be the first quest I complete in the Flaming Deeps. It definitely isn't usually. Let's see, what do I get? Hmm, nothing useful. Oh, ah. Uh, hey, I was just trying to si decide whether or n No, quit that! Quit that! Quit flying. <sighs> Quit flying and staying into a place where I can't reach. <sighs> Stupid draklings. That deed awards empathy, which is a virtue that I have equipped, but I don't think it's going to be a long-term one, so therefore I have little incentive to 
go and stay in here. If it were not for the prospect of finding me, Thrill, I would not have come here. Falgir has left quite a puzzle to be solved, eh? Thank you for sharing your discoveries with us. Moria is home to many wonders, and it gives us heart to see them being discovered. All right. There you go. And I have to... We will reclaim Pazadum for dying Ironfoot! Yeah, these will do perfectly. Good. Thank you. And that takes care of all of that. So therefore, it is time that we head back to the 21st Hall and bring the barricade materials to Broger. Here are the materials you asked for, Broger. My dwarves will begin assembling the barricades. Good. They begin to assemble the barricades and we will be ready to defend ourselves. But surely he'll have something else for me to do. And we'll find out what that is in the next episode of Piney Plays, The Burglar.